Ladies and gents, we are back. I'm your host, Sutter Strain Zero One, and I feel like every time I'm playing Red Dead Redemption, I feel like I gotta talk like I'm in a western. We got a few missions up today, and we're gonna go ahead and get started here. It's been a good day. Sun's out. Did a little hunting earlier. All fed up. Let's go get our horse. Head out. All right, so there is a lot of things that you can do with your horse. All right, let's see if it'll let us do it. It did it there a second ago. You can study your horse so you can see the info that your horse has. This is our main horse, My Little Pony. Now, what is the horse cargo that are stored on the horse? Nothing is stored on the horse right now. Items of the horse. Speaking of, I guess while we're in here, we can't get out our guns. We can't show our guns or anything like that. That's why it doesn't show up at all. But you're supposed to be able to look at your horse. And change outfits but unfortunately I don't see let's leave the horse somewhere a little bit away from here let's see if we can figure that out as well we're still learning the ropes about the game we're still learning everything you can do Arthur Miss Karen how you getting up fine so far and to think I was once a damsel in distress, and now they got me protecting the men. <laughs> Just stay alert. Oh, I shall do. And if anyone tries anything, I'll blow their heads off. But I don't see a way to do that just yet. Maybe we don't have that option available to us yet. Maybe there's still a few missions that we need to do before we can. So we're going to go ahead and head to our next mission. And I did see that little uh, obvious glitch there with the brush. That was actually pretty funny. But we said we're going to head down here, and we're going to see the Reverend. Let us begin. Now, following this path is the shortest, is what the game says the shortest way to get to your objective is. I gotta remember to turn notifications off, but uh, thanks for the message there, Nojo. I always kind of forget to do that. So one little tip in case you don't know is if you go into the cinematic view. Now, you can see it's following the road. You can actually let go and it will still. Help! Please! Uh, anyone! Oh. What do we got here? I gotta get out of here. Don't much like it around here no more. Glad I could help. Keep your eyes on the ground, huh? You'll be all right. Thank you. Oh, our guy's such a good. I like uh Arthur. I wasn't for sure if I was gonna like him or not, you know being the new in uh, new protagonist in the game. Swanson! You hear, Reverend? 
Swanson, you hear me? So it looks like he's probably inside. Swanson, you in here? took your advice, sir. I took your advice. Then your god has finally deserted you. What you talking about? I took your advice, sir. I have removed myself from Morpheus's embrace. No more shall I sink, sir. I am free. I am free. You don't seem free, friend. You seem drunk. Sit down, Reverend. We ain't finished. You ain't finished. Look at him, he's finished. None of us forced liquor down his throat, friend. I just want him to play. Now, firstly, we ain't friends. Don't make no mistake on that subject. Now, secondly, he can't hardly see, let alone reason. Now, reasoning ain't never been one of my strong points, neither. But seeing, I do just fine. You want to step outside or do a business here? I just want him to finish the game. Why can't we all just get along? These are good men, Arthur. They're children of God. They are children of God. How's about you playing this place, huh? That seems fair. Fair? Sure. You want a game? Sure. I'll play a few hands. Well, sit yourself down then. I'm Luther. This is Marvin. Fortunate for you both, we're being gentlemen about this. Same goes for you. So, how you two know each other anyway? Don't seem like the likeliest of friends, if you don't mind me saying. We go a long way back. And now you're his chaperone? I guess it's something like that. Can we play? He can't be no real clergyman. <laughs> He committed about five cardinal sins just in that chair you're sitting in. I think he used to be. He's drifted a little in recent years. Uh, life is a challenge to all of us. Can all right, we got a seven of queen and an eight. If he could stand up. On the fourth day, he turned water into whiskey, and I don't remember much after that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a play slow. He's a decent fella going through a bad time. Disrespect him again and you'll find yourself in a bad time too. All right, all right. Just trying to have a little fun here. It is a game after all, mister. I don't think. I'll check. That's good. Two pairs, queens and tens. A decent hand and a good basis to bet confidently. Sometime before we all grow old would be nice. Here. I'll call. Hmm. Okay. Here, look. Pile of crap. Not looking good. Come on! Could have been worse. <laughs> yes! All right, so I just wanted to show you a little bit of it. Gentlemen, this is getting too rich for me. Sit down. Oh, I'm done, friend. It's been a real education. Come on, Rip. Where is he? Where'd he go? Who? The Reverend. Where is... 
Excuse me, gentlemen. Reverend! Reverend Swanson! Where'd you go? Excuse me, I'm sorry. You, you see a drunken idiot, a priest, wandering about? Sure, we saw him, smelt him, and avoided him. <laughs> he went that way, I think. Thanks. Guy looked kind of crazy, mister. Well, you have no idea. Off him. Say a word. You'll keep. You stay out of it. Get your hands off him now, you son of a bitch. What the hell is your problem? He's with me. This all you got? You're going down. Ah. <gasps> ah. Ah. I'll kill you both. Ah. Try hitting me. Ah. 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 I'll smash your. I'm blocking it. You know, I've never been a big fan of the, uh, specifically of, of the combat in the Red Dead games. I'll be honest. They don't really feel like that good. See, because it just seems like they're always going to block. I'm back in with that. Oh, oh, God. Oh. Huh? oh my God! I killed him. I'm gonna get the law on you. Hey, you! Get back here! Can't catch him now. I said stop, damn it. Yep, okay. Okay. I, I won't tell don't hurt me. I promise. On uh, second thoughts, you can give me all your money, too. Okay, here, just take it. Just just please let me go. Don't make this hard on yourself. Oh shit. Got it. Whoa! Not... The law was alerted? Alright, so I didn't understand that one quite a bit. Now, clearly I know that I can get my weapon out, aim it at him, and he'll pretty much stop automatically. Oh my god, I killed him! I'm gonna get the law on you! You kidding me? Hey, you! Get back here! I said stop, damn it! Yep, okay, okay. I, I won't tell us so. me. I promise. On uh, second thoughts, you can give me all your money, too. 
Fast! This never happened. Okay. Reverend! Get off the damn tracks! Swanson! You crazy? Come on! A friend! It's just a simple mistake! You can... still be... saved! This place, I was stay. Get your foot out of here. Twist your leg, you drunken bastard. Get it. Come on. <laughs> 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 You. What the hell is wrong with you? Throwing me off a bridge like there that? There was a goddamn train, you crazy bastard! <sighs> Have I been bad again, Mr. Morgan? I'm sorry. Uh, I wish I was different. <laughs> Let's get you home. Home? Yeah, that's a wonderful idea. I could have tea with Margaret. Margaret? Who's Margaret? But... the way that missions work even though you know we're still learning and clearly uh it doesn't seem like um it's that much of a problem if you fail something you'll go right back to the last checkpoint which seems to be not too far away so you can get right back into the action again in these first beginning missions you're really learning everything what you can do what you can't do trying to gauge all of your meters and everything there's a lot more intricate things that you need to pay attention to kind of almost like it was back in Grand Theft Auto San Andreas we had to worry about your weight and all that other stuff so it's definitely added a lot of that but as I was saying before we started the mission and all that if you go into your cinematic it'll follow the road automatically and you don't even have to press anything so if you wanted to get somewhere, you wanted to go use the restroom real quick, oh, it will take you exactly chase. where you need to go. Where your, um, where your mission marker is, so you don't have to worry about anything. Uh, even though it actually says you need to press and hold down X, you don't actually have to do that, so. But of course it's not going to take, yeah. it's going to be a lot longer uh, to get there, but you oh. will still be able to get to where you need to go. Show up. 
Better sleep your way to salvation, my friend. Oh, what happened? Just the usual. Poor oh. bastard. Exactly. Well, thank you, Mr. Morgan. I'll keep an eye on him. He was lucky this time. Real lucky. Mission complete. Who is not without sin? Ah, uh, Mr. Morgan. Now, there are a few things that we can do back in town, and that's what we're going to do. We're not going to do Dutch's mission yet, because I feel like that's part more, way more part of the main story. So therefore, I don't want to, uh, you know, do those missions just yet, because of that. So we're going to head All back into town. Sir. Even though it is blinking, do you see how two of them are blinking? Now, I have no idea what the blinking missions mean. We're going to head over to LS. Which, if I'm not mistaken, nope. take us back into where we were before, close to Valentine. But there was... Actually, no, we're not going to do that. We're going to go over here. We got a bounty poster. Now, there was a doctor's office somewhere around in here, and people were saying that there was uh, something weird about the doctor's office. And that should be right there. So we're going to head there. I'm going to do a mix of a few different things uh, in this. So you're going to see missions. You're going to see some side missions. Yep. Obviously. But I mainly want to stick to main missions most of the time. But it feels like even these side missions have some unique de depth to them. And feel pretty good. Now, I don't think we can really fast travel too much yet. We haven't really Look explored. Look at dog's body. I told you he's your son. And I'm dead. Wow. Look how quickly you got to get out of there, man. They, they, they came up on us like it was nothing. I am red dead. <laughs> so now we actually can see what happens when you die in the open world when you don't have a mission attached to you and you can restart a checkpoint we lost $16 and we can continue to go back right where we were going see it's no longer there so it happened once but then it's gone so it was just a random thing too many enemies uh, taking me on it uh, too much there's the post office that signpost is how you can fast travel Fight every night in that shithole. Just show some respect next time. We run far worse than you out of town before. Oh, come on, man. Someone throws a punch, you punch back. Don't bother pretending different.
Hey there. Don't think I've seen you in here before. Gum, candies, tobacco. All the good stuff are on the shelves behind my counter. Tonics and medicines are on the table over there. Everything else, you should see the catalog. Thanks. Hey, careful there. Here we go. What are you looking at? What do you want? This is private. Get lost. All right, so I'm trying to figure out what we need to do. I hope you're wearing the mask to save us from something ugly. Sir. Ah, welcome back. Hello. You're starting to rile me now, pal. You get the hell out of here. Huh, so I'm trying to figure out how this all works. See, we don't oh, we don't even have any weapons on us because they're on our horse. Always forget to do that. Ugh. I'm not sure why he doesn't keep a pistol on him at all times. But that's something we're going to have to really figure out. Well then. Can't rob anything when you don't have a weapon. Sir, please. 
You don't want to get involved with them, I promise you. You make them open up, or you're a dead man. Hey, uh, open up. It's me. I uh, brought some food and whiskey for you fellers. Yeah, it's only the duck. Don't try anything funny. Thought you were that cowpoke who bothered us earlier. Put it on the table. Looks like a nice little business you hell? got going back here. Ah! What the hell? Gotta be kidding me. And we're stuck in this. Oh my gosh, so when you're in the middle of looting someone, you can't do anything. You can't get out of looting them. <laughs> so robbing this thing is actually much, much tougher than you would actually normally even think. I mean, this is really interesting, but there's just so much that you've got to really, really think about. We're gonna try this one more time. to you with that mask on? Let me into that back room of yours right now. Sir, please. You don't want to get involved with them, I promise you. You make them open up, or you're a dead man. Hey, uh, open up. It's me. I uh, brought some food and whiskey for you fellers. Yeah, it's only the duck. Don't try anything funny. Put it on the table. You can see we're in the middle of some business here. Looks like a nice little business you hell? got going back. <laughs> No, drop. I'm trying to pick up the money. Uh, I won't even show the money. We know you're in there. Come out now. Shit. Dumb move. Come out with your hands up. No, I don't want to pick her up. Oh my gosh. This is not good. Drop. Oh my god, what the controls. What the hell happened here? Nope, it won't even let me drop her. Hey! Oh my god, it won't down. even let me drop her. Ah! No, it's not worth it. Let's kill me. It's totally not worth it. Because it just seems like it's... Yeah, if you want to be... If, if, if you want to be, you know, if you want to just get in trouble and have everybody come after you, there's no way you can get in there and get out without them knowing. And it seems like the way that the mission is set up, they're going to shoot you automatically no matter what. So in my opinion, it doesn't seem... Look alive, fellas. I want to scalp today. Don't move. He 
He's open it. He's running. Well, I am wanted now. All that for nothing, huh? Oh, they're still coming after me. And this is only, this is my fault. better. All right. Okay, man. Wow. So that tells you right there, do not try to rob someone just out of the blue. You can take out the people, but then you just don't have enough time to go in, grab the loot and get out of there. Everyone's going to be on to you. And now I'm completely wanted in that section there. Yep. So if I'm spotted again in that red area, they're still going to come after me. Now, is he going to want to shoot me? This is, we're testing the waters here. Wait just a yep. Uh, you dare show your <laughs> Avoid them or pay it off in the post office. That's what I wanted to see. All right, right now I know. You let this <laughs> All right, so it's as simple yeah. as going to a post office to pay it off. I think that's pretty much what you could do in the last game as well. If I'm not mistaken. we now know right that's the whole point is we're learning seeing what we're going to be able to get away with what we're not going to be able to get away with why we're going to go ahead and go to the post office now. Uh. <laughs> oh. Give me a minute, please. Glad to see you on the up and up. Hmm? Yes? I hope you understand that I was set up, but uh, you know. All right, so then we should be good to go. See you around. I guess that's all it really takes to lose your bounty. But it was interesting that we found oh, out about that, girl. so it's really not productive for us right now in the beginning of the game to try and... Well, I mean, rob anyone right now. All right, so it looks like we need to brush our horse. So let's try this. Let's see if we'll get that same weird clipping. 
No, that Very time it worked a little better. All right, let's see what missions we have. So we got off the beaten path a little bit there, but we're learning the ropes and everything that the game has to offer. There's a business um, back there, but you can see that, you know, it's it's just not worth uh, not worth it anymore. I think we already actually still took it down because we took them out, and then we died after we took them out and took the money and took the loot and all that. So I think we're 100% fine now so the only thing left is we're going to go and do i guess this uh thomas downs mission then after the thomas downs mission we've got uh javier all the way out there i don't know what the wanted dead or alive thing is but that's probably a big story mission right there and then we've got a few out here as well head to a new area so we're gonna go ahead and ride up we're gonna talk to dutch and uh, see what a quiet time is all about. So right now we're going to go ahead and head back to camp. Like I said, we're going to be doing a mixture of main yeah. missions and some si side things. Excuse me, I got hiccups. Side things in every single video. But I will label the exact missions that we are doing so you guys know exactly what you're in for if you have any trouble with a particular mission. This is one of those games that's going to take hours and hours and hours to complete, so lots and lots of videos. So I'm just warning you guys about that. There's going to be a lot of videos. Morning. back on your feet in no time. I sure hope so. John is always everywhere we actually go in. John is always there. Good old Bill. <sighs> Good morning, Arthur. How dirty our faces. Well, since we're going to go ahead and sleep and then do Dutch's mission in the next video, I think sleeping's going to cure all of our ailments. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. We got into uh, some very... <laughs> very crazy things here today. Got a letter. Dear Arthur... I've written this letter a hundred times or more, and I cannot get it right. It's me. You know it's me from the bad handwriting. I know I said when we last spoke, and I was going off to get married, that we would not speak again. I know I said a lot of things, and I meant them, I suppose, at the time. But I'm not so proud as to not speak to people who care for me, or cared for me. I've been in Valentine for a couple of months. I had some bad luck, and, well, it's a long story and not an interesting one, but I am here for now. I saw a couple of the girls, or whatever the polite term is for them, that ran with you and your associates in town, and I heard tell of a man who sounded like you. I would love to see you again if you could spare me a little bit of your time. I'm renting a room at Chadwick Farm, just north of Valentine. Yours, Mary Linton. I'll be honest. Hang in there. Mr. Morgan, can, can I? Are you okay? Yes. I was miles away, I'm afraid. So it seems. Anyway, it's that fellow Downs. The, uh, do-gooder? Exactly. 
We lent him quite a sum. It seems like he has little intention of repaying us. He was quite ridiculous when I went to see him. You, uh, you've not been to see him yet, I take it? Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, it's just... had a lot on. I'll go give him a gentle reminder. Not so gentle. I don't like his kind. Superior. As you wish. All right, so it looks like we've got a new mission as well um, that we've already kind of accepted. It's kind of already uh, made us go. So we'll check this out in the next video. Hopefully you guys are enjoying, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace out.